समटाइम जब आप विंडोज इलेवन और विंडोज टेन में लॉग इन करते हैं तो फिर आपके सामने ये एरर आता है वी कॉन्ट साइन इन टू यू अकाउंट दिस प्रॉब्लम कैन ऑफ इन बी फिक्स बाई साइनिंग आउट द अकाउंट तो समटाइम आप जब इसको साइन आउट करते हैं और साइन अगेन करते हैं तो ये प्रॉब्लम फिक्स हो जाता है देन यू कैन लॉग इन टू योर अकाउंट विच यू वॉज यूजिंग बिफोर विद ऑल योर डॉक्यूमेंट्स एंड ऑल योर डाउनलोड्स फोल्डर एवरी थिंग इज देयर बट समाइम इस रिस्टार्ट करने के बाद भी आपको यही होगा यही लॉग इन स्क्रीन आ जाएगी एंड आपको वो अपने अकाउंट में लॉग इन नहीं करने देगा यू कैन सर्च फ्रॉम हियर बट इन माय केस आई कैन नॉट इवन सर्च एनीथिंग सो आई कैन नॉट इवन क्लिक ऑन एंड इज नॉट कमिंग अप फॉर मी सो बट इन माय केस इज नॉट वर्किंग सो मैं जो हूँ um, दूसरे तरीके से जाऊँगा मैं आई एम राइट क्लिकिंग go to the task manager and when the task manager start hopefully so i'll go in there run a new task look at my desk space is running like 98% i don't know what is running behind but let's see so cmd so in there i need to write uh, who am i slash user t this is the SID. So we'll just keep note on that this SID. I'll leave it open, and now I need to run a new task, which is um, reg edit. I think it is the one. Okay. So it will open the reg edit for me. So now I need to. So I'm going to local machine. Then I'll go into software. Then I'll search Microsoft. Microsoft के बाद we need to go to we need to go to Windows NT. So let's search Windows NT folder and after that current version. इसमें फिर हम profile list. This is all list. ठीक है. So अगर आप यहाँ पे देखें कि कुछ files folders बने हुए हैं जिसके अंदर एक folder जो है वो back का है. dot back और अगर मैं ये करता हूँ तो दिस इज माई एस आई डी विच आई एम लॉग इन टू एट द मोमेंट विच इज दिस सो इफ यू कैन सी हियर इस आई एम लॉग इन विद सी यूजर टेम्प्रेरी अजलान पी सी सो इट इज अ टेम्प्रेरी प्रोफाइल बट माई एक्चुअल प्रोफाइल इज दिस विच इज सी यूजर होम सो मुझको यहाँ पे लॉग इन होना चाहिए था बट इट्स लॉग इन मी हियर आई गॉट अदर यूजर्स एज वेल बट आई एम नॉट वरीड अबाउट दो जस्ट when i'm trying to log into this so mere paas jo hai wo this is logged into the temporary folder so how i will get rid of this so i what i need to do i just need to get rid of this folder yes so this is become only the only folder we need to make sure this is going to the right path see user home and just need to make sure like what is the state so it should be zero make sure it becomes zero after that yes and we need to rename this 2 123 like that yes so this is done now what i need to do is just need to restart this pc and see like it will solve the problem for me or not if it is not then we will go for the second option which is um, create a new user and move all the documents and folders to that new user so we can use that it is just this is happening because of um the corrupt user profile so we try to solve it let's see this works or not so you guys know that i cannot even write anything in the start menu so what i'll do just try to run it from here shut down Slash R to restart the PC. If if your options working here, then you can directly do it from there. So because my options are not there, I cannot even use it. So I'm just trying to do it from here with the command line. Let's see. Yes, you're about to sign out. All right. Close. Okay. Okay. So I log in around after restarting. So let's see. Can you guess how it is? And कितनी देर में ऑन होता है तो 
देखते हैं ये टेम्प्रेरी प्रोफाइल में जाता है कि ये डायरेक्ट ही माय एक्चुअल अकाउंट के अंदर लॉग करता है फिंगर क्रॉस और मेरे पास फिर से वही एरर आ गया है जो पहले था तो जो भी मैंने प्रोसेस किया ये प्रोसेस जो फर्स्ट प्रोसेस था ये कुछ सिनेरियो में काम करेगा और समटाइम इट विल नॉट वर्क तो मेरे सिनेरियो में काम नहीं किया so now i need to go and then do the rest of the thing now so uh, to create a new account and move all my data to that account so let me see okay just like aap logon ko pata hai ki uh, our first process was not successful so we need to do the next one which is create a new user account and move all the old data from the the old account which is somehow got corrupted profile user profile corrupted so i need to move to the new user account so uh, um oh good thing is that this one is working now after restarting the pc i can see the start menu as well and i can search so that will be easier for me now so uh, i need to search settings and in settings i can go into the accounts and family and others account so here i need to add the users uh, i got some other users as well which definitely definitely i will be blurring it um <laughs> okay so i'll go in and add someone else to this pc so let's see uh, i don't have this person send information so we just need to click on that and it will take a little time yes now add a user without a microsoft account so i don't want to do that this is a name is i'll do it um it was home before the username was home now i will change it to my name which is uh hr's pc let's see uh password is up to me uh oh god and i will fill up this all information so i filled up this information and uh, fill up the secondary questions as well and i press next so you can see there's a account here change the account type to administrator yes Good. Now, because this is a JAS PC, I need to log into that account. Then I will go and move all the data from old account to this new account. Yes. Okay. Let's do that. With that, I will sign out from this account. Yes. So now I am logging from a JAS PC. this is my new account so hopefully there will be a no hiccups in logging up this account it will take time because this is the first time i'm logging into this account so i'll come back continue so this is wide okay so without your data don't allow don't allow so good thing is that i am logged in into my new user profile so let me just make sure where i am logged in i'll see cmd so who am i slash user is so it is a jas pc yeah right click and open one more so there is two you can see move here and one other one is here yeah i'm just trying to create two separate windows so we can see where the we are moving the data to so it went users so that was my home user because i got the administrator rights because i'm logging with the hrs pc so i got the administrator rights of that so 
Okay, so it takes already like four or five minutes now. I'm trying to open this folder, which is my old uh, document folder, uh, but I cannot do that. Okay, so I tried too many times now. So it just opened now. So look at that, how much time. I think maybe it took me around like six to seven minutes to, to go into this folder now. So there's a lot of my data in there. Okay, so control A will select all the folders and files. Control C is copy everything. I will open another explorer and go into my account, which is my new account, which is HRSPC, and just paste it here. Let's see. Can I do it or not? Do this for all current document. Administrator permission to copy this folder. Continue. Look at that, it is 7680 GB of data in there, in this user. And I'm copying 70 to 80 GB of data into this account. So it will take time, definitely. Let's see how long it will take, I'll come back. So to, time is 14.53 now. Let's see how long it will take. Okay, guys, I am back after one and a half hour almost, and still is running. Oh, and it's just gone off, so it's 100% done. Um, you can see, so it's all in here. Yes, so we can close this one up, which is the old user, and uh, all working. So all the um, icons came up here, so it's good. Um, yes, everything is there. If registry added, solution doesn't work then you need to do the second one and it is working so if i go and not disconnect i will shut sign out and send back in again after some time let's see so now i'm trying to sign back in let's see it will the same login or it will generate some other ones oh it is not so it is using the same profile the one i created and i move from the old profile to the new profile so it is using the new one newer one now it did not create any temporary profile for me so it's working so guys hopefully you will learn something from from this and um, see you next time don't forget to subscribe bye bye